Good afternoon. We're here at uh, Mechanic Street in Gorham, Maine, and we're here looking at the first uh, delivery of our wind turbine for wind from Windtronics, and we wanted to give you guys a look and uh, see the unit as it comes off the truck. Uh, here we go. All right, Skip, let it rip. Chanel from Energy Installations riding the truck. Drop her right off. Oh, she's a beauty. Now we lower her down. Right. Hey, Skip. So basically, this is if if I was a customer um, ordering my ordering my wind turbine, this is what I would be receiving when I get to the house, correct? This, this is what we would receive. Yes. And then we would then transport it and bring it out to where it needs to go. Right. And uh, the installation then proceeds from there, depending on how we install it. Right. And but it crates up from the factory this way, this way we receive it, and it's all in one piece, it's all balanced, it's, it's mm -hmm. precision aligned and all of that the way it sits. Mm -hmm. So all we have to do is pull it out and put it on a support groove on, on some kind of a base, depending on what, the, what we're going to put it in, mm -hmm. or on rather, and uh, fire it up, you know, elect, you know, power it up the way we need to with whatever electronics we need, electrical service mm -hmm. we need to connect it to. And then we're in business, and the other box is the electronic gear that comes with it, and that's the smart box, it's called. And this is a, what we call a blade tip power system. And all the flux, all of the energy is developed in the outer blades and the outside of the blades. Mm -hmm. You look in here, you can see the stators and the coils are in that arrangement. And instead of a hub, the hub itself is a ceramic uh, bearing system that's uh, in the center. There are no, uh, there's no friction point there, or there is a friction point, but it's very little. Mm -hmm. And uh, from that point on, uh, uh, the it operates on two mile an hour wind or more, where the others generally run at around seven or eight before they kick in. Right. That's what I was going to ask you. Basically, that the design of this wind turbine is um, capable of, of rotating and then generating power or electricity with lower wind yes. movement, correct? Yeah. You said two miles an hour? Two miles or better. Yeah. Two miles or better. And then uh, it follows the wind, it'll actually turn into the wind. Right. Uh, it, it, it monitors itself for maximum wind exposure. And it sits on a 360 degree rota rotating uh, slip ring system mm -hmm. on the base so it'll turn any way the wind goes. Oh, really? Okay. Well, fantastic. So, um, this is the first one. Yes. Uh, this is, we're going to hook this one up here on one of our buildings uh, and we're going to uh, run some tests on it. We're going to put a data logger on it. We're uh, essentially going to. Uh, re-evaluate uh, all of the mounting options uh, and we've got uh, adequate engineering from the factory for some of it mm -hmm. uh, for what they've developed and then of course we have our own engineers here that we're going to task uh, specific installations if necessary to make sure we got uh, structural and civil engineering adequate to be able to put it up there and expect that it's going to stay there in all weather. Mm -hmm. Right. All right. Well, more to follow. Yep. Shortly. More to follow. Uh, stay tuned. A couple of weeks from now, we'll know a whole lot more. And we'll have a video while we're on the roof. Yep. All right. Excellent. Thanks, Kip. You bet. Thank you.